Dear viewers, Drishti IS welcomes you to the new series of To the Point. Today's topic of discussion is Lassa fever. First of all, let's see why is it in the news. Recently, a case of the death of one of the three persons in the United Kingdom, that is UK, diagnosed with Lassa fever was reported. The cases have been linked to travel to West African countries. Now let's understand what is Lassa fever. This is a virus that was first discovered in 1969 at a place called Lassa in the West African country of Nigeria. The virus was named after the town as Lassa. The discovery of this disease was made after two nurses died in Nigeria. The fever is primarily found in countries in West Africa including Sierra Leone, Liberia, Guinea and Nigeria where it is endemic. The fever that comes from Lassa virus infection is called Lassa fever. Now let's discuss how does it spread. The fever is spread by rats to humans. One can become infected with this disease by eating food items that are contaminated with the urine or feces of an infected rat. It can also be spread if a person comes in contact with a sick person's infected bodily fluids, orthomucus, membranes such as the eyes, nose or mouth. However, the infection does not spread through casual contact such as touching, hugging, shaking hands or sitting near an infected one. Apart from this, people usually don't become contagious before symptoms appear. Its symptoms are Symptoms typically appear 1 to 3 weeks after exposure. Mild symptoms include slight fever, fatigue, weakness and headache. Whereas in severe cases, the patient starts having difficulty breathing. Along with swelling on the face, problems like chest, back and abdominal pain etc also start to appear. And in severe cases, bleeding may occur. Now discussing about the impacts The risk of death may increase from 2 weeks of the onset of symptoms. In this, death is usually a result of multi-organ failure. However, the death rate associated with this disease is low, that is around 1%. The rate may be higher for certain individuals such as pregnant women in their third trimester. The highest effect of this disease has been seen in pregnant women. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention that is CDC the most common complication associated with the fever is deafness Nearly 1/3 of those infected report various degrees of deafness In many such cases the hearing loss can be permanent Significantly deafness can occur in both mild as well as severe presentations of the fever According to the European Centre for Disease Prevention and Control, about 80% of the cases are asymptomatic and therefore remain undiagnosed. Now let's discuss the way to avoid getting infected. Avoiding contamination of food with rats and their feces or urine etc. by staying away from places where this disease is prevalent as an epidemic and maintaining hygiene now it's time for the practice question consider the following statements 1 lassa fever is caused by a virus spread by rats 2 the most common complication associated with the fever is blindness which of the above statement or statements is or are correct one only two only both one and two or neither one nor two send the answer of this question in the comment section stay tuned for the next episode thanks for watching have a great day
डियर व्यूवर्स वॉच दिस टॉपिक इन हिंदी ऑन आर दृष्टि आई एस हिंदी यूट्यूब चैनल